The following video contains... Wait, 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 wait. This is not a sensitive topic. This is about two people who happen to be uh, friends of mine who just got married. So, this is an absolutely different, uh, different insight or different uh, content for this channel. So, uh, I suggest you watch it from start to finish. I don't know if it's gonna be awesome, but yeah, please do just watch it. Hi guys, Ian here. Uh, just a disclaimer, this is going to be a behind the scenes stuff. Because uh, the, the day that I have recorded this uh, preview, uh, yesterday actually, uh, prior to this recording eh, nag ako ng kasal it just so happened to be uh, my friend's wedding and uh, hindi ko lang hindi ko lang kaibigan hindi, hindi ko lang pare, pareho, pareho kong kaibigan yung bride and groom and uh, I would like to send my best wishes disclaimer lang promise I sobrang hindi naman sa pangag ako or whatever pero so, sobrang overflowing na emotions ko kasi pucha never in my life na nagkaroon ako ng kaibigan na ikakasal and doubly so na kaibigan ko talaga sila kaibigan ko yung, yung babae at yung lalaki and I was part of the nuptial entourage so for the first time ever in my life eh, na ano ko to na hindi man na-achieve pero na-invite ako on that matter so yun lang uh, kasi nandito ako sa Makati I I'm editing this stuff so please do enjoy it I hope you will enjoy it kahit medyo pangag ako and uh, I hope that I can edit this properly so yun lang uh, please watch it hi guys Ian here uh, today is the 7th of September 2019 and narito ako ngayon sa Mela Hotel dahil inimpitahan ako maging abay sa kasal ng isang kaibigan. So, ito yung mga kasamahan ko na kapwa abay din. <laughs> or groomsmen. So, after you, sir. Thanks. So, ito. Eh, dahil medyo, ano, medyo nag-ano kami. Uh, around 11 na ba, sir? Mag-12 na. Ah, mag-12 na. So, kakain na lang muna kami. And uh, what's good about this hotel is uh, may mga kainan sa labas as you might see later on. Okay, so medyo mahangin. Nung dumating ako dito, yung, yung pintuan ng kotse na sinasakain ko, lumipad talaga. Well, not literally, pero talagang na-extend siya. So, sa, so, ewan ko kung bakit, pero you know, it's a lot better than the fact na mainit tapos walang hangin. Kaya pasalamat na lang tayo sa Diyos at mahangin. <laughs> so, pagkatapos namin kumain, uh, meron kasing simbahan malapit dito. Eh, itong lugar na to kasi medyo notorious to. If you might, uh, if you might uh, imagine, pero I'm not delving into that. I'm delving into the structure or the church that is nearby. So, yun lang. So, ito yung Santuario de San Ezequiel Moreno. Uh, named after the saint who once was the pastor or parish priest of Las Piñas. At yung kasal ay mangyayari dun sa mismong simbahan na naging, ano siya, naging kura siya. But this one, this is very, very recent. This is very, very recent uh, than the, the old church. Ayun. So, 
I guess at least naka pasok kami na simbahan nakakain na rin so natuwag na namin lahat relax na or or is it gonna be relaxing abangan brunch time kung, kung ano na lang pinag-uusapan dito Well, it's around Let's do this. <laughs> Tapi Ano dapat ano? Peter Parker. Spider So, hihintay na lang na mga all that other stuff. So, bahala na. Okay, anyway, uh, eto, live na. Eto yung groom. Hindi kami kumasya sa elevator dahil kay Ian. Walang iya ka. Hindi, ano, ang malaki talaga sa amin, ako, tsaka si Kuya Kaloy. So, yun lang. Well, continuing pa rin yung shooting. Ganto talaga, pag-abay. So, there's nothing I can do. Be back in a moment. Okay, so, natapos din yung mga ritual. So, eto. Naghihintay na lang kami pumunta ng simbahan. So, just a quick recap of who's getting married and all that. It's my friend, Mox Vitasa and Anna Kosho. Actually, parehas ko silang kaibigan. Prior to their relationship, eh, sila na, I mean, kilala ko na sila pareho. Both as individuals. The first time kasi na nakita ko si Mox, ano siya, yun din kasi yung first time na nakita ko si Lovely, yung girlfriend ko. So, talagang medyo memorable din. Sayang nga lang, hindi siya makapunta. Ah, She didn't, I mean, it's not that she doesn't want to, pero kasi conflict sa schedule niya. Kasi nga may, ano siya, may Italian class. So, eto, I'm baking myself in the sun. Security detail daw. <laughs> pero, ayun nga, uh, I would like to express my best wishes and congratulate, and my congratulations to both Mox and Anna. You guys rock. Anyway, what do you want to say to Keno? Keno, Mox, and Anna? Mox, Anna, finally, we're going to come back to the day we've been waiting for. And the day that we have been waiting for also for the union. We're so happy that God put you together. We're so happy that you found each other in this life. I wish you all of 
the blessings in life, all of God's blessings and all of our best wishes na magkaroon kayo sana ng, ng isang magandang buhay together, a life full of happiness, full of adventure, full of meaning, and most of all, full of the leading of the Holy Spirit. So, Anna, Mox, take care of each other, love each other a lot. God bless you. Amen to that. So, ayun. So, yan si Kuya Kaloy. He's a married man as well. Sayang wala rin si Ate Esti yung ano niya, asawa niya. So, at least makaka, ano rin ako, makaka, ano yun? Makakomiserate din ako, di ba? <laughs> so, yun. Uh, so, naghihintay na lang kami ng, ano, simula ng nuptial mass. So, eto na yun. Oh, and one more thing. Actually, ano, Gino ko yung mga ano coordinators dito kung bakit ko kung paano ko nakilala sina Mox at Ana. So sinabi well, parang na joke sa akin nung ano nung no <laughs> coordinator eh ako ba yung nagtulay? No, hindi ako nagtulay. I am actually rooting for Kuya AJ to become his best man pero may kapatid siya so automatic na yon. So yun lang. <laughs> I guess si Kuya AJ ang nagtulay, hindi ako. Okay? Yun lang, yun lang yung clarification ko doon. Sige na, I gotta go. Bye! Okay, so nandito na tayo sa simbahan. This is Saint, uh, Saint Joseph Parish. And these are the people that is part of the wedding. <laughs> Ito ang parokya ni San, Jose, San Ezequiel Moreno rather. So, dito. Whatever. Anyway, eh, magsimula na ang wedding, so I gotta get a hat. I gotta get the hell out of here. Take this, all of you, and turn from it. For this is the chance of my blood, the blood of the new eternal covenant, which will be poured out for him for men for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. More often than not, yung mga original na mga, yung mga original na mga requests ng mga ilang bride and groom mas malala pa. Talaga, lang talaga all sorts of secular songs in the mass. Yeah. So to sort of restrain that. Kung baga ano, kung baga at least ano, sa sa at least ano, actually na sabi ko naman ng mga mas na ano, na ayon yan. Oh, just one ano. At least, at least. After nung bisa talaga, um, so it's it's not ideal. It's yeah, not absolutely ideal. not. But hanggang it's a way. Hanggang hindi ko cringe ako actually. It's a way to restrain mm. worse things because I've I, in the past na I've been to weddings na talagang covertory ang kinakanta, secular love songs talaga or talagang talagang ano nothing sacred. So at least. Whether it's a compromise, some of the things that we're doing. Or the compromise that the full repertoire of the mass is not only secular songs. Yes. So, of course, we look forward to the day that people understand the sacredness of no secular songs. Of course, of course. And I really do, I really do admire the the music that that uh, UNST had on Sundays. I really do admire. It. Sana on during it when my turn comes, yun nga, ganun din. I think it's possible. Yeah, siguro ano yun, ganun, pakagasapa ko lang din si Lovely, siguro. Yeah. Yeah. And that is Kaloy Palad and his commentary about all these secular love songs sa mga weddings. Overview, walang secular love songs sa kasal na to. Thanks be to God. Nung natapos sa misa, doon nangyari yun lahat. So, well, still, props to the, ano, props to the singers and the organist today who is playing the bamboo organ. That is the bamboo organ right now. Sayang hindi ko, ma hindi ko ma record yung mismong doon sa mismong misa. misa pero, uh, still, shout out sa nila. You guys are doing your job. God bless you all. I'll be right back. So, ito ang bagong kasal. Mabuhay. Mabuhay ang bagong kasal. So, let's do this.
Okay, so pasensya na kung pangit yung ano, quality kasi nasa loob ko rin ng kotse and uh, kahit paano naraos namin nakaraos kami sa kasal so iraraos na lang namin ang reception sana wala kaming gawin <laughs> di ba? yes, yes <laughs> matulog yes, I have to be the shotgun guy nandito ako sa shotgun seat <laughs> later guys Okay, so na dito na ako sa Espacio Events Place. Uh, this is in BF Resort, so uh, medyo hood ko to. Kasi nag-aaral ako sa Bloomfield Academy. It's just a few meters from this place. Kaya medyo alam ko to. Alam ko to lugar na to. Ang nakapagtaka lang, bakit ako lang yung pina to? Pero wala, pero that doesn't matter actually. Pero okay lang. Let's just have fun while it lasts. At pasensya na, na-overpower ako. So I gotta get this. At kutom na rin ako. So I'll head right in. Be right back. <laughs> anyway. Ito pawi na kami, ito si Kuya Roji, si Kuya Kaloy, and malapit na rin ako baba. Pero kung medyo familiar kayo sa Mercury Drug na yan, at dun sa viral video na kalalabas lang uh, just this month or whatever, yes, that's the place where three muscle-born homo homosexuals uh, beat the shit out of a security guard I mean, ewan ko ah nagkataon lang na out of gas out of gas sila ay out of gas siguro Roji and I told him um, may, may, may gas station malapit dito sa dadaanan da, 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 natin and ito, ito lang naman yung pinakaunang gas station after oh, na ano <laughs> anyway wait lang ah <laughs> anyway, ayun na, na share ko lang Pauwi na rin ako I'll, Ayun, so I'll, I'll be right back Babalik ako I mean, record na lang ulit ako Pag uwi ko na Okay, pag uwi na, pag uwi ko na I have a lot of things To say to all of you Hi guys, I'm back from uh, back to, on my house and um, I got two problems. Number one, I pass uh after I sleep tonight. And number two, how the hell am I going to edit this? So, siguro out of siguro ng gagawin ko na lang out of respect to the newlyweds, papaunahin ko na lang muna yung uh, yung same day edit nila at saka yung full uh, wedding day video para paglabas na paglabas nun ready na rin yung basically yung ano na to, yung video na to uh, by the time na by the time that I've up uploaded this on YouTube kasi uh, since behind the scenes yun uh, syempre I wanted to make sure na the focus would be on the newlyweds and uh, their newfound uh, mission on being a family and uh, sa totoo lang paiyak na ako <laughs> I have to admit paiyak na ako nung ano nung do sa, sa nuptial mas pa okay, kasi so, sa totoo lang with all of the stories that I've heard from Mox and Anna as well as from my as well as from our my other friends uh, who are in the, at the at the wedding na ano na na they're already married i mean it's more than it's more than what i've uh, what i understand so with all that taken into consideration of course mm, yep sample ito Anyway, ayun. So, 
this is just a reflection. I mean, naging reflection na rin yung um, araw na rin ito. I mean, self-reflection na rin. Kaya, medyo, medyo napapaluha na rin ako. But, it, um, during the day. Kasi talagang, bukod sa, bukod sa, na-witness ko, or nasaksihan ko, yung, progress progre, progression ng pag-ibig ni Namox and Nana uh, for the past 6 years 7 years I lost count pero promise I have I have very much admired both of them not only in their advocacy but also in their relationship to each other they've stood for each other and talagang hands down talaga ako sa nila. and as well as for other uh, the other folks who just got married especially si Kuya Kaloy and si Ate Esti and uh, actually talagang nagpapasalamat din talaga ako na binigyan niya ako ng uh, overview on the first day of uh, married life during the during the wedding itself wedding day itself and um, yun yan, papasalamat din ako sa lahat ng mga, hindi mga unsolicited advice, pero uh, overview on how family life revolves. Of course, I also have to thank my mom and dad. Kasi, una sa lahat, wala ako pag wala sila. Number two, siguro through them, through their first hand, first hand experience that I've uh, I've the first uh, na experience ko first hand sa kanila yung mga pangyayari sa bahay now I understand that it doesn't uh, doesn't just it's it isn't the the exam it isn't I, I mean our situation is not uh, special or it's not um uh um, identical or sabi natin hindi siya yung typical tal or sabi natin uh, exceptional ba I'm I'm at loss of words promise I am at loss of words for all that I have witnessed today and uh, I don't know uh syempre, it's really very 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 uh tiring day so yun uh hindi yan luha Ano yan? <laughs> uh, pawis yan. Kasi sobrang yun talaga. And yun lang. I really am at loss of words for all this. Pero I am very happy. I, I mean, na-experience ko na talaga na maging abay for the first time in my life. Pero sa totoo lang, sa totoo lang, it's not just that. It's not just that eh. I mean, the fact na kilala ko na tong mga, kilala ko na yung ikakasal, from the moment that they were, in, uh, the, the, that they were in a relationship, hanggang sa ngayon, I mean, it's very, it's a very, spe- it has a very special uh, place in my heart. Yung pag-aabay, yung pagiging groomsman, secondary na yun eh. I never expected that until the last freaking minute. So, yun. Uh, hindi ko na, hindi ko na, uh, papahabain pa. Kasi, baka mahaba na rin talaga to. And, hindi ko na talaga sure kung paano ko talaga i-edit to. So, hindi ko lang, basta. I'll, I'll just take the pains of, uh, editing this and get and before that get some sleep kasi talagang inatok na rin talaga ako and all the emotions are there and mind you it's alcohol free so yun <laughs> anyway um with all that said this is Ian and until then see you next time congratulations and best wishes to now Mr. and Mrs. Vitasa bye guys have a good night it's really a privilege to be part of the bridal entourage, eh, the nuptial entourage. So, talagang 
since first time ko yun, mixed emotions and all that shit. So, uh, yun lang. And uh, siguro ang reflection ko lang dun is, or yung insight ko dun is, uh, life is just like that. Na um, talagang aanuhin mo. Talagang marami ka talagang may experience na ganun. And soon enough, may experience mo rin yun. Ganun. So, I guess that's about it for this video and for the whole behind the scenes stuff. Uh, after this clip, siguro yung mga rejects or yung mga medyo funny moments. So, do enjoy it. Hi guys, Ian here. Uh, ito. Hindi, pwede magpa-assist naman sa... Hi guys, Ian here. Ito lang yung doon. So, okay, so, uh, pagkatapos namin kumain, uh, Back to the hotel we go! <laughs> the perks of being a, a groomsman. First time to actually. <laughs> Tina natin. Sana magka baby kayo agad. Ano bang ano bang masasabi ko?